So I don't know if y'all seen or not, but Butler Kennels just got audited by the AKC. And when you get audited by the AKC, that means they coming out not to say, oh, you're a great breeder. They coming out to tell you that we don't want you using our name for anything anymore. And we need to try to come get some evidence to prove that you're a terrible breeder. So Butler Kennels, right? And it just killed me because he made a video about it and he was so humble, right? This one thing Butler King Kennels can't do with his dog. He can't really just show you the detail on any one of them because they all look like shit. This is Vader Timator, son of Magistar Timator. You feel me? My dogs come from world famous bloodlines and they look amazing. You feel me? But anyway, back to the story. Butler Kennels, right? I mentioned something to Butler Kennels online, you know, because I love these dogs, man. And it's about the information, the education, and the betterment of this breed. You feel me? That's what we represent at Giant Rottweilers. You feel me? So he over there running a puppy mill, and he got like 20 dogs and a 20, like 50 dogs, not counting the puppies that he got, right? Just running a puppy mill. And basically, the AKC came out. And had some questions and, you know, did a did a check and stuff. And they're basically trying to take his his um, AKC paper. So if you actually do buy a dog from him, you got to know that they're in the process of trying to gather evidence on him that he is breeding bad dogs. That means you're keeping them in confined conditions. You're not taking care of the dog properly. You feel me? You're keeping the dog in the cage 24 hours a day like you feel me it's a murder it's a mass murder or something and you know despite popular belief man you know what i'm saying these dogs are very unique these dogs don't need a lot of space anyway to begin with so the dogs are very mild mannered very intelligent you see how this dog completely making eye contact with me and one thing somebody pointed out to me in the video where he's showing you his raggedy house where he's keeping a ton of dogs in the heat trying to act like AKC gave him some approval, but really they only come out when you something's wrong. And when there's smoke, there's fire. But here's the problem I'm having with everything is he got in my DM and attacked me so bad and disrespected me. Told me he was going to kiss, kick my ass, call me out my name and everything. You feel me? Just very disrespectful. And he's supposed to be one of the top dog breeders. If you look at it, you feel me? He really don't know what he's doing. So when somebody questions you about how you're raising these dogs and you get an idea and attack them, and then those white people come to your establishment and you humble yourself, it's just crazy to me, bro. Like, if you was taking care of your dogs like this, they wouldn't even come bother you, man. And I'm just saying, man, with a dog like this, man, if you go look at Butler Kittles and look at them backgrounds, man, you feel me? That shit look terrible on you. You should feel sorry for them dogs kept like that. You feel me? You should get your dogs from a reputable breeder that don't got the AKC trying to shut them down. The AKC just don't pop up and come to your compound, bro. Unless you're doing something to them dogs and they see something wrong, man. And um, it's just a shame, bro, because you, 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 you got at me so disrespectful. Disrespect them like that. I'm just saying, you humbled yourself now and made a video. And y'all should check it out because he lying in the video, but... I mean, you can see his whole operation. I mean, man, selling a bunch of dogs, you know what I'm saying? And ain't taking good care of them. But yeah, man, we out of here, man. You know what I'm saying? This giant rock kennels, man. That shit was a trip, man. That video, crazy as hell, because that man disrespected me like that. But when they pulled up with the same issues, oh, now he, now he bowing down to the white people. That's crazy.